So hey my YouTubers and everyone in the world, today is January the 28th, the time is now 2.24pm, so yes, it was a beautiful Monday all day, if you guys are new to my channel, please make sure you hit that subscribe button down below guys, because it only gets better, and if you guys have already subscribed, then welcome back. But moving forward, today we're going to be talking about different reasons why people play the blame game. Why are people so quick to blame someone else for their own actions and their shortcomings? Reason number one is because that is a defense mechanism. Especially when a person know that they're wrong about something and they don't want to admit it, it's easier to blame someone else than to take fault for your own actions. So that's one of the reasons why people play the blame game. Reason number two is because people blame other people for their shortcomings because honestly speaking, guys, they are in attack mode. See, that's what it is. They are ready to attack you, if not, you know, physically, then emotionally. And what easy way to attack someone than to sit there and blame them for something that's going wrong. Reason number three why people play the blame game is because, honestly speaking, guys, a lot of people do not like to take responsibility for their own actions. So at the end of the day, it's like, okay, well, you know what? Sometimes this is what I've learned. People do not understand why other people do the things they do, let alone themselves. Meaning that sometimes we do things and we don't even understand why we do it. But we just know that we do it and, and that's what it is. And then when there's repercussions for that action, you know, instead of taking the responsibility and saying, well, you know what? I was wrong about that. A lot of people are so quick to say, no, it was this person's fault or it was that person's fault because it's just easier to do that. And it's sad, but it's the truth. Reason number four why people play the blame game is because people are liars. And I'm not saying everyone, but there are a lot of people out here that are so quick to lie about things and then sit there and point fingers elsewhere because Obviously, they don't want to take, you know, responsibility for what's going on. These are some of the reasons why people play that blame game. Because honestly speaking, guys, it's so easy to sit there and say that it was someone else's fault rather than to take responsibility and say, well, you know what? I was wrong about that. People are not responsible, you know, and this is why they play the blame game. It's so much easier to just point fingers your way rather than mine, or take a look in the mirror and say, you know what, this is something I need to work on. So I hope that some of the things that I mentioned today actually help you to realize that this is the reason why some people actually play the blame, the blame game, because they can't even help it, you know, especially if they're a liar, um, forget about it. You know, they're never, never say, okay, something was my fault. You know, they'd rather just be like, it was someone else's fault. But I hope that those tips helped you guys on um, why people play that blame game. And I, I hope and pray that if you are one of those type of people, that that's something that you definitely work on because um, it's nothing positive about it. But like I always say, guys, like, comment, subscribe, and share. And of course, visit my website at shoploveronline.com. Until next time, guys, let's have a better understanding of why people play that blame game. Peace.